You even, are you even wearing it? Yeah, look. It doesn't show up on me. It really does not. <laughs> Hi, <Sorry>. guys. So, <laughs> it is currently our last day, or mm -hmm. our last night in Orlando. We're leaving tomorrow morning to go back to Durham mm -hmm. and go back to school next week. But <gasps> we had a great trip, and so mm -hmm. we just want to tell you about... I'm just gonna do it like this so that my hair doesn't show. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so with that, uh, what was I saying? Day one, what did we do? Um, we went to the park and then we went to the podcast. Yes. Um, which was really fun. Yes. So, currently working on a blog post about our trip, um, which will be up very soon. Um, probably before this goes up actually, but uh, I wrote about it on there, how we went to a podcast taping of a podcast called Harry Potter and the Sacred Text, where two former divinity students from Harvard read the Harry Potter books like it's a sacred text. And it was awesome, and they were super funny, mm -hmm. and um, the audience was very into it, mm -hmm. and it was at a fancy hotel. Taking him seriously, that he did not hesitate, but jumped out of bed at once, pulling on his dressing gown. Day two, we spent most of our time waiting in lines. The lines were very long. They were. But it we was spent a like Sunday. 12 hours at the park. We spent a very long time at the park. Morning. Oh, sorry. Ready for battle. What did we do that all night? Day. Mardi Gras. Oh, yeah. It was that night. Oh well, yeah. yeah, there was Mardi a Mardi Gras parade. Um, I don't know why I just did that. And <laughs> <laughs> I can't, I can't laugh. Because um, I actually used to live in New Orleans, and so I feel like I was reliving part of my childhood. Um, we caught a lot of beads, mm. and mm, I found the rest of those. Did oh you see? Oh my gosh, that's what that was. I put them on the bed. Oh, I put we them on the ground. We lost half of our beads. Yeah. But then I found them because they were under my suitcase. And I was super nice and I split half of mine because my parents taught me to share. <laughs> um, yeah, so they did a Mardi Gras parade. They had a whole French Quarter set up with like mm -hmm. all the typical like New Orleans type food. So mm -hmm. um, I got a shrimp po' boy. Cassidy got... I got a chicken po' boy. Yeah. And it was amazing. <laughs> it was so good. Oh my gosh. Good. <laughs> King cake and mm, which and I haven't beignets. had yeah and beignets which king cake I haven't had since I was probably like seven or eight oh. um, but yeah beignets which were great mm -hmm. um, dipped in chocolate sauce and so I drank lots of butterbeer this weekend mm -hmm. I had or this week I had one every day um, at least one every day at least one I think yeah I feel like I think I limited myself to one, but I had a lot of other really yummy stuff too. Yeah. We had lunch one day at the Three Broomsticks mm -hmm. um, in Hogsmeade. We had lunch today in the Leaky Cauldron in, Cauldron. in Diagon yeah. Alley, which was cool. It was all like British food, so I had fish and chips. Mm -hmm. And then you had chicken today. Yeah, today I had a chicken sandwich. Um, on Sunday I had mac and cheese. Yeah, it was great. <laughs> Very I'm a child. Um, British. <laughs> Literally on the kids' menu. We met the conductor of the night bus. Gary is a I am a great navigator. <laughs> yes, you are. Don't add anyone tell you to. Yes, we met the conductor of the night bus and the conductor of the Hogwarts Express. Oh my gosh. We met the beat builders. Oh yeah. Oh my gosh. <laughs> So she the beat builders losing it. Are she loves them. The best. They are um, not even like one group. It's like different people every day. <laughs> but I love them, and they're so good, and they're so funny, and they're great dancers, and I love them. They're really cute. Yeah, and I got a picture they're with really them, and it cute. was really fun. So that was a, a highlight, mm -hmm. personally. Oh, we oh, saw the, the Hollywood makeup show. Yeah, that's what I was about to say. Today, which was um, hysterical. That was, okay, it was so funny because I feel like we didn't learn anything about yeah, Hollywood no. makeup at all. It was just these two women like doing like audience work. Basically stand up, yeah. <laughs> the whole time. And then, it was just stand up about yeah. ostensibly about makeup, but barely. Yeah. Stuff, if you could easily grow stop, just close your eyes. But let your kids watch. 
and they like pulled in this woman from the audience to like be part of the stunts and stuff and her husband <laughs> slept through the whole thing. Was sitting thing. right next to me. Her husband was in the seat next to me. It was so was cute. Was dead asleep. I thought he was actually dead. I kept yeah. like checking for breathing. Even like the com- comedians kept asking. They were like, yeah. is he okay? Um, is he still alive? She, one of the, the hosts came and like sat right next to him yeah. and was like shaking him. And, like, like talking like, in his talking face. Talking in his face and he did not wake up this until man, the show was over. Yeah. Hey Rocky. Rocky. Is he alive? Is he alive right now? Hey Rocky. Wow, he's out cold. But the show was great, so we got to like see a little bit about how they do Hollywood makeup and stuff, but yeah, like Cassidy said, it was mostly just to be funny. Is he drunk? (laughs) No judgment there if he's on vacation. I'm your real dad. Stop it. Put on your tummy. There were a lot of rides that we rode a lot, so we Mm -hmm. rode all the Harry Potter rides like three times each, I think, Mm -hmm. so there was Harry Potter and the Forbidden Journey, which is like, it Mm -hmm. takes you through Hogwarts and kind of um you go through this entire simulation of like playing quidditch and like seeing dementors and like scary spiders and Mm -hmm. um it's really cool oh my gosh the spiders Um, are terrifying yeah definitely the one i got the most motion sick on well the simpsons ride too well yeah the simpsons ride was weird and like my least favorite yeah (laughs) um do not recommend i was not a fan yeah for real and then the green gods ride is so awesome um, so you basically go through Gringotts, which is like the bank mm-hmm. in the Harry Potter world. Plus Bill Weasley's in that one. Oh my gosh, awesome. and we love him too. A lot of the rides we went on were like 4D, so they give you glasses mm-hmm. and like kind of like 3D screens, but also a lot of like special effects in mm-hmm. real life and yeah, a like mixture. Yeah, spray you with water a lot and sometimes yeah. like there'll be like fire on it's the a lot of fire. and the room gets hot. Yeah, yeah, so like a mix between like a real set, <clears throat> but also mm-hmm. screens and stuff. Mm-hmm. One time... And, like, the Spider-Man one, I think that was today, right? Where, like, mm-hmm. it, like, pans from being in, like... Oh, like a, an actual brick wall? To, like, to like a fake, fake brick wall? But I thought it was a real brick wall still. Mm-hmm. Like, the way they, like, panned the ride. Yeah. And so it started to break. And I was and like, like, oh, my God. Start, like, like that's cool. You, but, like, they're 3D. Yeah. Like, they're fake. But yeah. it seems really real. <laughs> I was shook. <laughs> and we'd been on that ride before. We just went on it, like, yesterday. Yeah. And, yeah. And then both times... Anyway. Um, I completely forgot that they like take your picture in a really awkward spot. So I yeah, literally, so just like, instead of like screaming yourself, I was like, <laughs> <laughs> it's like completely straight face. Yeah, I hate it. So that was upsetting. So we definitely did not buy any mm-hmm. pictures or anything. Mm-hmm. We finally went on the Jurassic Park ride today. Oh my god, my favorite ride. <clears throat> which Cassidy's been dying to go on <laughs> all week, and she keeps like, every single day I talked about yeah, it. Yeah, she like, like, let's go on the Jurassic Park ride today. <laughs> she kept like politely hinting at it, and I was like, yeah, we'll go, but like it wouldn't be super wet. But actually, we didn't actually get that wet, uh-huh. and it was totally, it was like the first thing we did today, and it was really fun. The dinosaurs um, are so cute. I love them all. They're very cute. You know who else is cute? The, the scorpions. scorpions. Yes. She won't shut up um, about these scorpions. Oh my gosh, my face is really hardening. Okay. <laughs> Um, so wrap it up. Um, yeah, so exactly. Take these off. Um, I won't shut up about the scorpions, but this one won't shut up about her sore forearms. So I feel like okay. we're pretty even. I hung um. <laughs> forty feet in the air by my fingers. It yes, was extremely but... difficult, and my forearms are very sore. I'm having a lot of doms today. <laughs> yeah, I feel that because my arm is sore holding this camera up right now. So I feel like it's the same thing. We. Uh, what was I saying? Oh we did Fear Factor Live. We did Fear Factor Live. Like what we're and I at. feel like that is something that, like, I I just, I don't see us doing it. Like, I just, that was very unexpected, I feel like. And I'm, we did it basically on impulse, and I'm really glad we did, because we knew that if we didn't do it, basically when we like felt right like then, doing it, yeah. we were never going to do it. She peer pressured me. I did. Into doing it. And I have I no not, regrets. I did not want to, but I'm glad I did glad I made a fool of myself in front of It everyone. was so great because, um, well, really it was great because she got a free t-shirt out of it and we both got I pictures. I got a free t-shirt. Which is great. But yeah. Um, yeah, so there was a critter challenge, a food challenge, and a physical challenge. And mm-hmm. so Cassidy did the physical challenge mm-hmm. with this guy um, and his girlfriend slash not girlfriend, which slash, I don't know what's going on there. I hope but, they watched this. Um, but they were great. <laughs> they were like the nicest people. Um they were so sweet. Yeah, so, they were really, really nice. Except yeah. I was no match for this man. 
My name is Cassidy, I'm from Cary, North Carolina, and I'm gonna win Fear Factor because my best friend is in the audience and she doesn't think I can do it. I didn't say that! <laughs> the farther we slide to the end, the closer they are to dropping. 15 seconds! Oh, we are in the Cassidy dropped! He was very athletic and he was very really tall. Good. <laughs> And really good at everything, and I didn't even get halfway through the last stunt because he I, had already finished. But we were talking about it because we literally saw four shows because we saw one show, mm -hmm. then decided to like go to casting, but we missed it. So then we just like watched that show. Then we came back and I did mine, and then so mine was like the critter challenge, and there was a big wheel with like all the bugs on it, and so then Cassidy got to like spin it and decide my fate. We have giant cockroaches. Snakes, a tarantula, and even emperor scorpions, Ooh, which are by far the nastiest of the bunch and my personal favorite. Cassidy, quit that thing, Cassidy. Come on over here. You're going to give her some moral support and then put her on YouTube. <laughs> and then. Except it was fake. It was fake. I know. I told the Fear Factor the lady. Secrets. I told the Fear Factor lady I wouldn't tell anyone, but it is fake. They choose scorpions every time. Don't tell anybody. <laughs> but um, yeah, all ten people who are gonna watch this. That's rude. <laughs> that might be true, but it was rude. And then that was the third show, so I did mine. And then there, we watched the fourth show where Cassidy did her uh, physical challenge stunt mm -hmm. stuff, and I sat in the front row and recorded. So, um, but yeah, it was it was really 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 fun. Mm -hmm. Glad we did it. And then we sent mm -hmm. the pictures and the videos to our professor, <laughs> and we have a lot more to show him when we get back. Yeah. Um, and he called us cool. Well, he responded we cool. and said very cool, and I think he's talking about like the, the experience. fact that we did it. But I feel like he's saying that we're cool. But like cool. deep down. Yeah, he thinks we're cool. I think I think he doesn't know that he knows that we're cool. <laughs> we look really saying. cool we right now. We always look cool. Um, I look really cool in my Grimald Place hoodie sweatshirt thing. I caved, I saw it, and I loved it, and oh, then yeah, I bought I it. Oh, yeah, I want to talk about our souvenirs. Oh, well, yeah. Hello. Okay, don't show me because I don't have pants on. Okay. <laughs> I'll just have the camera on me the whole time because I'm really pretty. We can cut this part out. We rode all the rides. We went shopping. We ate a lot of food. We went to the Chocolate Emporium. That was amazing. We've had the best day ever. Yeah, we amazing. competed on Fear Factor Live, um, which we'll tell you more about. I got killed, but it's fine. <laughs> but it's fine. And now look at where we're about to have dinner. Oh my gosh, okay. I don't know how to turn the camera around. So hold on, we'll just do another video. The Chocolate Emporium. Oh. <laughs> I don't think it goes all the way in. <laughs> Oh, all the beads. So these are Mardi Gras beads. We got so many. It was fun. I was stealing them out of hands of children. Oh yeah, that's the story I had started to tell. So yeah, there was a very aggressive little girl standing next to me. Well, yeah, she <laughs> at the business. parade. She really wanted the beads. Yeah, she did. No, but the great thing is that we sat on the curb where am I? We here, we were here. sitting on oh, a curb. Shoot. I don't know how to hold a phone apparently. And we just sat there. Like a bunch of lazies, and we still yeah. got a lot. Yeah, and everyone else was standing. All and the we other still losers were standing. Yeah. Okay. Okay. I got two journals, and I'm very excited. Am I holding the journal, it or are you holding, you're holding it? it? Okay. But I'm angling it. There's this one called A History of Magic by Bethilda Backshot, who um, is low key dead and taken over <laughs> by. Oh my god, I almost said by <laughs> Niagara Falls. What's that <laughs> Nagini. Nagini. <laughs> Nagini. Niagara Falls. <laughs> so I got this really cool. Weasley sweater. I don't I don't know how to how to vlog. So yeah, it's this amazing sweater. It's like 95% wool, which means it's V itchy, but I love it. And it says H for Harry, but actually it's H for Holland. I've decided. Which is Cassidy's last which name. Which is my last name. <laughs> that didn't make any sense. Yeah. <laughs> Next. I got suckered into getting these like cheap plastic things. So this is what I got my souvenir mugs. In. 
<laughs> it's so close to my face. <laughs> like going cross-eyed. <laughs> and then this thing, which I got a huge like strawberry peanut butter ice cream sundae. Oh my gosh, yeah, look out for and pictures I, of I that because it's wild. I was extremely excited about it and I wasn't even hungry, but I just got it. And I got some saltwater taffy from Honey Dukes, which, fun fact, this is like... This did someone eat them? I have no clue. Like, did the cat come in here and like try to get into it? Maybe. <laughs> um, but That's funny. The very first people I ever shadowed for to like get my hours for physical therapy school, I brought them this and they loved it. I also got peppermint toads at Honey Dukes, but yeah. I already ate all of them. Whoops. Yeah, I ate my caramel apple. Oh yeah, um, she got the like the world's biggest caramel apple. Like I don't under understand. It was a normal sized apple. It was not a normal sized apple. This was a GMO apple. It was really good. I got my mom a really nice Harry Potter Christmas ornament, but yeah, it's yeah. all wrapped up nice, so I don't feel like getting it out. I got a little mason jar thing. Um, that says Honey Dukes on it, which is like the sweet shop in Harry Potter world to put my saltwater taffy in, which I'm extremely excited about mm -hmm. that aesthetic. The moral of the story is it was a great trip. It was. And we had it a lot was of fun. an awesome time. Yeah. Now we're in bed in face masks. We're going to watch TV. Oh my gosh, the part we left out, which I guess we blocked out from our memories, was that we took an entire study day. <laughs> Good morning, everyone. We are on day four, I want to say, of our trip. Um, we did three straight days at the theme park. Um, probably the coolest part was doing Fear Factor Live. I actually have, I don't know if you can see, but I have like raised red bumps all right here and i thought i was breaking out but i think it might have been the goggles that i was wearing for fear factor were too tight um so really hurts tried to put makeup on it um but so worth it really really cool um so now today on day four we're taking a study day which is kind of a bummer but we do have exams coming up and so we're gonna head to a coffee shop uh, make some study guides try to study for our exams a little bit so that tomorrow our last day at the parks can be a little bit more stress-free um, and we feel a little bit more productive before we get there and Cassidy's back she forgot her headphones like a loser okay bye breakfast time got my bagel got my iced latte got my Cassidy <laughs> Oh, that's cool. Well, fun fact. I, I watched The Bachelor. <laughs> so what's heartbreaking is that I actually made a study guide for the wrong material. And so none of it applies to our exam next week. But it's fine. It'll be on an exam eventually, but I didn't actually study it, so I don't know it. But at least I have somewhat of a study guide ready. Yeah. We just took the day at Einstein Brothers Bagels, whatever it's called, and then yeah. went to Starbucks when they kicked us out. Yeah, they um, did kick us out yeah. after a while. And then went to a fun Mexican so, yeah. restaurant. Oh yeah, Chewy's. Yeah, like that. it was great. Yeah. Anything else? What was What was your favorite so. part? Oh my gosh. Um, I think my favorite part was. So I really like all the rides. Mm -hmm. I also really like just like walking around. Yeah. Harry Potter world. You and, really like, like looking, people watching. I really like people watching. Yeah. That's one of my favorite activities. Mm -hmm. And there's some good people watching to be had at <laughs> theme park. Probably watching me <laughs> mess everything up. Yeah, it's awesome. Um, so yeah, just like walking around and like looking at all the stuff and like watching all the kids. There were so many kids there who were just like having the time of their life. Yeah, and they I were lit watching them. Some of these kids, like you could clearly tell like it was like the best day of their life. And it made my heart really happy. <laughs> Again, it was me. No, I'm just kidding. There, there were a lot of kids like that. It was awesome. Mm -hmm. I think my favorite part, really, it was all honestly so perfect. But yeah. I really liked the shows that we went to. The shows were so, really like, good. So, like, even the podcast recording that we went to. Mm -hmm. And then there was, like, the Triwizard Spirit Rally. Mm -hmm. There was, that was um, really good. singing that we saw. Yeah. There was the, a telling of, like... The Frog Choir. Yeah, the Frog Choir. Celestina Warbeck from mm -hmm. Harry Potter. We saw the oh Blues gosh, Brothers. Oh, really cute guy up on stage. Um, like, oh, yeah. Well, <laughs> oh, my gosh. Someone edit that out. Um, and then the horror one... Yeah, the makeup one, Fear Factor. And the Beat times. Builders. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the Beat Builders were I love the Beat Builders. builders. Were good. They were great. Um, they weren't that good. Beat Builders, if you're, if you're watching. <laughs> if you're watching, all like hit us up. 35 of you that probably play that role. Yeah. Yeah. Let us know, because we're interested. <laughs> Marry before her.
untimely death appeared and once before him, yet soon she turned sad and cold, for she did not belong in the mortal world. that we got and they're matching and we just went on the forbidden journey ride and it was, it was great amazing. and we screamed the whole time yep. and we're rewarding our cowardice with these pins yes and I love it <laughs> Cassidy, how are you feeling about being super early? So happy. Today's going to be a great day. It's going to be a great day. We're sitting on the ground and it's wet and humid. <laughs> um, and there's still like 30 minutes till the park opens. Okay, bye.
these four days were absolutely awesome. We are headed out of the park, just left Diagon Alley for the last time, but we made sure we rode Gringotts one last time. Um, and I don't know what we're gonna go do, but it's been great. We got to eat at the Leaky Cauldron, we've eaten at the Three Broomsticks, we've ridden pretty much every ride possible. Yeah. Um, Multiple times. Right. And it was just great. And I'm now a Hogwarts alum. You can't even see it. There we go. Hogwarts alumni. It's legit. That actually makes me mad that the shirt says that because alumni is plural. It's true. Maybe we're both alumni. They need grammar checks on their Hogwarts merch. <laughs> okay. <laughs> on that note, we're gonna go and we'll see you for our recap. That's it. It was just a great trip. It was a great trip. We had a lot of fun. Yeah. Um, we have to drive 10 hours home tomorrow. Now I gotta clean all these souvenirs up because I had <laughs> yeah. packed them up already. Yeah. That's why I didn't get my ornament out. And also I got a Jaws t-shirt for my dad and I didn't get that out either because oh, yeah. I already packed it. Okay, thanks for watching. <laughs> Bye! Bye.